Hello friends, today we are going to see some dark secrets of Taj Mahal and how it ruins Shah Jahan and led to the colonization of India. When foreigners hear the word India, the picture of Taj Mahal enters their minds. For many local and international tourists, a photo with Taj Mahal will be on their bucket list. The word love is often associated with some million things in the world. No other worldly thing is more associated to love than the Taj Mahal. Situated in the banks of river Yamuna, the white mausoleum was built by Shah Jahan as a resting place for his wife Mumtaz. The white Taj Mahal has its fair share of hidden secrets which says a different story. Shah Jahan took the throne of the Mughal dynasty after the death of his father Jahangir. Shah Jahan proved to be a great emperor managing people and rebels in the kingdom. Shah Jahan also indulged in promoting arts and music in the capital while his son Aurangzeb was strolling in the heat of Deccan. The death of Mumtaz, Shah Jahan's beloved wife, took a toll on his health mentally and physically. Shah Jahan shaved his head and refused to use perfumes. After days of mourning, Shah Jahan decided to build the magnificent Taj Mahal as a monument to Mumtaz. More and more taxes. The Taj Mahal started as a colossal project with funding from the court. As the cast swell up the building of the Taj Mahal swallowed the entire Mughal treasury Aurangzeb was annoyed by the government spending on Taj Mahal and voiced his concerns the grieving emperor did not heed his son's warning the builders of Taj Mahal spared no luxury the more expensive items are from India and also across the globe were gathered in Taj Mahal to make it magnificent As the funds were not sufficient, subjects of Mughal dynasty shared the emperor's grief by paying more taxes to fund Taj Mahal. Negligence in Governance Taj Mahal construction attracted the entire Mughal government missionary. Taj Mahal construction was the main project in the mind of the whole Mughal dynasty. The vast Mughal government missionary was focused only on building the monument. Shah Jahan even deployed the Mughal to protect the the marble shipments to Taj Mahal so that they could arrive on time. That negligence led to rise of rebellion in the country. Colonization of India As a part of financing for Taj Mahal, Shah Jahan borrowed money from all corners of the empire. The money poured in his coffers and the Mughal dynasty was depleted of the existing financial status. As a last resort, Shah Jahan started issuing trading rights to European trading company to make money. Shah Jahan was also getting loans from European powers and struggled to repay it. Shah Jahan had to seat some territories to repay these loans for European powers. One of the corporations Shah Jahan borrowed money was from the British East India Company. The East India Company eventually conquered India and made Mughals a puppet ruler. The British government eventually took over the East India Company and ruled India. India directly until independence in 1947. In 1877, 20 years after the fall of the uh, Mughal dynasty, during the Great Mutiny, Queen Victoria became the Empress of India. It was the start of uh, the European colonization of India. The only person close to Shah Jagan who opposed building the Taj Mahal was his son Aurangzeb. As a result, Aurangzeb was transferred and was led to burn in the growing sun of Deccan for 30 years. Aurangzeb spent decades fighting rebellions against the Mughal dynasty for his opposition against the Taj Mahal. Famine The entire Mughal granary was emptied to feed the construction workers on Taj Mahal. India was facing massive starvation during the period of Taj Mahal construction. The diversion of essential food items worsened the famine, causing the death of millions of civilians, wishing only once. The cherry on top of the entire colossal tragedy was the fact that Shah Jagan visited Taj Mahal only once in his lifetime. Shah Jagan, after the construction of Taj Mahal, visited it only once before moving to Shah Jagan Abad or modern day Delhi. Ironically, Aurangzeb was so distressed at seeing the state of Taj Mahal during one of his trips. He appealed to Shah Jagan to spend some money to maintain it. Final Days After Aurangzeb seized the throne of the Mughal Empire by a coup, he kept Shah Jagan in a house arrest at the Agra Fort. From Shah Jagan's private quarters, you can see 
the full view of the Taj Mahal. Many speculate Aurangzeb wanted to keep the ailing Shah Jahan happy by allowing him to see Taj Mahal every day. Also something Aurangzeb want Shah Jahan to see his colossal blunder every day which brought in the decline of the Mughal dynasty. After Shah Jahan's death, his body was buried next to his wife Mumtaz in the, inside the Taj Mahal. Thanks for watching today's video. If you like the video, please share, like and subscribe. Bye.